Now, there is a member of parliament from uh, northern Uganda who has threatened Honorable Bobby Wine, the president of NUP, that he shouldn't make any mistake of going to the burial of the late right Honorable Speaker of Parliament, Jacob Olanya. Yes, this member of parliament from northern Uganda is saying, Mr. Bobby Wine, don't you make any mistake of heading to northern Uganda. Hey, I'm going to tell you who this member of parliament is and a section of Ugandans are wondering whether this member of parliament know who Bobby Wine is in this country before putting out these warnings to him. Do you know who Bobby Wine is in this country? <laughs> First check yourself. Anyways, uh, subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Now, before I go to Bobby Wine's story, uh, Bebe Kul's son, that is a K-son, has been very sick for the last five days, suffering from malaria and infections. Bebe Kul says it's been a very tough time for him, but the good news is that uh, K-son is now stable. Yes, K-son is now stable. However, Bebe says K-son needs more prayers. Yes, so as you pray right there for your problems, you can also forward a prayer to K-son as well. Yes, right here on the Buzz UG, I wish him a very quick recovery. Now, going to Bobby Wine's story, I told you that uh, there is this member of parliament from northern Uganda who has threatened Bobby Wine not to make any mistake of heading to northern Uganda for the burial of their son, that is uh, Jacob Olanya. Now, this member of parliament is called uh, Lillian Abba, and uh, she's a woman member of parliament representing Kitugum district. Yes, Honorable Lillian Abba has warned Honorable Bobby Wine not to make a mistake of crossing to northern Uganda for the burial of the late speaker of parliament, Jacob Olanya, before he apologizes to the people of Acholi. Now, Lillian says Bobby Wine's supporters protested outside the hospital where Jacob Olanya had been taken for treatment. That is in Seattle. I think we all know this story. Yes, we all know this story. It has been the biggest story lately. Uh, so Lillian Abba says Bobby Wine has to first apologize on behalf of his wicked supporters before he makes any mistake of heading to northern Uganda for the burial. Now, in her own words, she said, those were NUP supporters without doubt. Bobby must come out and apologize to the Acholi community. If he doesn't want to apologize, then we are very sorry for what shall happen to him. He will not cross Karuma Bridge. My guy, this is a very serious threat. This is a very serious threat. But wait. She's talking as if Bobby Wine had already communicated that he's going for the barrio of uh, the late speaker Jacob Olanya. Has he already communicated? Maybe somebody should uh, update me on that. Has Bobby Wine already communicated that he's heading to northern Uganda for the barrio of uh, Jacob Olanya? Anyway, uh, that is a horrible Lillian Abba, the woman member of parliament from Akitugum district. And of course, she says, Bobby Wine, you have to first apologize to the people of Acholi before you think of heading for the burial of their son, that is a Jacob Olanya. So I'll keep you posted in case the spokesperson of NUP, that is a Joel Senyonyi, or even Bobby Wine himself responds to this lady about this matter. So what you have to do, subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't, and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Thank you.